Well, you know, every month we're showcasing the people and organizations making an impact in their communities. They're called our Go For It winners because they're really making a difference in the work that they do. Victor Williams shows us the winner for July. Well, our winner this month around is Tamisha Rouse. She's the founder and CEO of For Our Grieving. And for years now, she's been using her grief as a tool to help others. I just want them to come into a building and talk to people that they'll know that there is sunshine after this. Since 2013, the nonprofit For Our Grieving, AKA FOG, has been teaching adults and kids alike a variety of ways to cope with loss. We try to bring hope and sunshine to people's lives who are going through grief. And as we know, grief can deal with the loss of anything, not just a death. It all started, however, when Tamisha lost someone close to her on a holiday of all days. 2010, Thanksgiving Day, November 25th, my older sister, Talia, um, died on her way to my house for Thanksgiving dinner. That was the first real death that I ever experienced. Unfortunately, Tamisha was also coping with several miscarriages, but when she took in her sister's kids, finding help to heal was hard. But there were no places for us to go. We were either in the wrong uh, hospital facility or I either made not enough money or too much money um, and we didn't have any programs for kids who were grieving. Now you can find Tamisha writing books and being a help to anyone going through the pain that she once faced alone. I just want to thank everyone for coming out. The future holds a lot for fog and the goals being made to help even more people than before. I'm looking for something called Hope House where people can just come and just um, feel a presence of peace. I have so many ideas and so many things that I would love to do. And once again, congratulations to Misha. If you guys would like to learn more about For Our Grieving, you can head over to our website, clickondetroit.com. Victor Williams, Local 4. All right, thanks, Victor. Now joining us is Tamisha Rouse of For Our Grieving Kids and WDIV's Vice President and General Manager, Bob Ellis. So, Bob, I'll turn things over to you. Well, I'll start by saying um, how pleased and proud we are to present you with this month's Go For It Award. As the, as the plaque reads for embodying the go for it spirit and making an impact in our community. And so on behalf on Channel 4 and our partners at Henry Ford, uh, Health and the Masco Corporation and the Gilbert Family Foundation. We want to thank you for what you're doing to make Southeast Michigan and Detroit a better place to live. Thank you so much. Thank you so much for this award. Tamisha, I know that uh, oftentimes community members focus so much on adults and how they navigate the grieving process, but we often don't pay attention to children and their vulnerable, sensitive, emotional needs. How often do you see that and how do we navigate that? Yes, that's such a good question. I'm a retired teacher, so I saw it when I was teaching. Students looked, they were tired, they were angry, they were mad. And so I made sure that it was my, it was my goal to make sure that those children were no longer sad. So we have to navigate it, we have to watch the children. We, they do grief a little bit different. They may not always be sad. Their grief comes out in anger and sometimes just want to be alone and not bothered. So we want to make sure that we know what the children need. And that's the real thing to make sure it's key to know what each child needs. Tamisha, are families taking advantage of the resources like the ones you provide or is stigma still a reality in a situation blocking some people from reaching out? Unfortunately, in our city, stigma is still something that we see a lot of. We don't get as many parents and families involved because they don't think they need us. And it's not always about grief for death. It's about any type of loss. Yeah. They can have moved to a different school or had a fire or something of that nature. So we just want to make sure to let everybody know that we're open and available for everybody, even the parents, because sometimes they don't have the tools that they need to help the children. Well, Tamisha, we definitely appreciate the work you and your organization are doing. Bob, thank you so much for being here and presenting Tamisha and for our grieving kids with this Go For It Award. And if there's anything you want folks to know, wrap it up real quick, just to let them know how to reach out to you. Thank you so much. If you want to reach out to us, go to our website at www.itsfoggy.org. And we want to let you know that it may be dark now, but there is sunshine after this. Thanks, Tamisha. And of course, we'll have that information for you on clickondetroit.com.